Is it enough to imagine yourself wealthy and to repeat positive affirmations? No, it doesn't. If you have strong negative emotions and negative uh, beliefs about earning a lot of money, every effort to change this will have either a little effect or it will fail entirely. So what do you need to do? Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Vivi and today I'm going to show you how to do the inner work necessary to change your financial situation. So stay tuned. The first thing you need to do is to ask yourself, how do you feel about money? What is the dominant feeling? You may be feeling powerless, hopeless, helpless, guilty, abandoned. You may have this sense of responsibility and obligation, or you may be feeling trapped. What you need to do is to write everything down and work on each emotion separately. These emotions and feelings may be interconnected, but for the time being, work on each one separately. Let's assume you're feeling powerless. When was the first time you felt powerless in your life? And why are you feeling powerless now? We have the tendency to transfer feelings from one area of our lives in another. For example, you may be feeling powerless in your relationship and transfer this feeling into your financial situation and vice versa. Go as far back as you can in your childhood and try to remember the first time you felt powerless. What was happening back then? How was your relationship with your parents? With your school friends. Try to recall a time when you felt completely powerless. Children have a limited mental capacity to process strong emotions and limited beliefs. Therefore, these emotions and limited beliefs remain in their minds and are attached in any situation that bears some resemblance to that very first event, the first time they felt powerless. The first event is the most powerful one. Finding that first event you felt powerless and process those emotions and limited beliefs will have as a result to neutralize those emotions and therefore you will be able to replace them with something positive. Now, something very important. You need to work on the negative emotion first. A limited belief is hard to change when it is attached to a negative emotion. So what you need to do is to work on the emotion first, neutralize the emotion first and the limited belief will follow. There are countless of modalities you can use to change that. I use emotional freedom techniques, it's known as tapping, but feel free to use any modality that works for you. When doing the inner work, try to be as open-minded as possible because what you think the block is may not be. I've written an ebook that will undoubtedly help you in answering all of these questions. You will find the link in the description box. So that was it for today. Thank you very much for being here. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe, like and comment below. Let me know how you do the inner work. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Lots of love.